So, without further ado, Mr. Lee Jackson is going to talk about scratching. Lee Jackson, come on, yeah! Great. Thanks, Ivor. Can you hear me okay? Great. Sound problems tonight. How are you all doing? Very good. Very good. Now, are we ready to go for it? Go for it. Great. I spent most of my life uh, scratching. Save the jokes. I've heard them all. Believe me. Right. But I spent most of my life DJing in schools and uh, in competitions. I was a runner-up in the Northeastern Heat, so the DJ mix competition. So I was one of the best DJs in the country. In the 1980s, I was a fashion icon, as you can tell. That was, my that was my bedroom, that was my first set of turntables, which was basically my dad's hi-fi that I robbed off him and broke. Uh, that was basically how I started DJing, using um, these big black CDs that some of you might have seen before. Um, some of you have seen a few of those. But there you go, that's my turntables in 1985, that's worse. But basically it all started, and I, I mentioned this in March last year, uh, the, earlier in the year, it all started with a guy called Cool DJ Herc, who was pretty good. Um, that was how hip hop started. However, DJing was started, really, in 1947, in Otley, at a jazz event by Jimmy Savile, ladies and gentlemen. Rest in peace, Sir Jimmy. He did indeed, because DJs at the time had one turntable. They would put a record on, and they would put a record on, and when the record finished, they would talk about it and put the record on. And he was the first guy who said, basically, can I have two turntables, please? And the PA engineer said, why would you want two turntables? So Jimmy Savile, God bless him, is actually a DJ legend in many ways. So here we go, DJ Cool Herc. He took the old funk records, and basically let them play like this. What that basically is, it is an old funk record that's just extended. So if, you let, if I let it play, you'll hear the full record. You got it, you got it, you got it, you got it, I know you got soul. Which is like a James Brown and Bobby Bird song, okay? So that's basically what it is. And break dancing is just extending the break, instrumental break in the record. That's why it's called break dancing. And that's exactly what I showed you just now. But scratching is something different. And that was invented by Grand Wizard Theodore. And basically, he invented it while his mum shouted him because his tea was ready. And so he held the record like this. <laughs> Sorry for the noise. He held the record and he <laughs> invented it by accident. So, who'd like to have a go right now? We're going to have live scratching with volunteers. Who'd like to have a go? Yes, Richards, first up. Can we, can we have a woman as well, please? Because that, that would only be good. Yes, thank you very much, madam. What's your name? Quick, quick. There we go. Over this side, over this side, over this side. Basically, what you got to do is just follow what I do. It's very simple. So just follow what I do like this. Okay, that's pretty simple. So uh, just put your hand on the record like that. A little bit of movement like that. That's all you need to do. Just a little bit, that's it, that's it. And the crowd, the crowd puts their hands up in the air like this, moving from side to side. Fantastic. Isn't that brilliant? Even ginger people can scratch, ladies and gentlemen. Isn't that brilliant? Now, yes, what's your name? Emma. Emma, come on, Emma. Are you left handed or right handed? I'm right handed. You're right handed. Come this side, Emma, this side, Emma. There just uh, put your hand in that little area there, and a little bit of movement like that. And the crowd puts their hands up like this. Let's do it for Emma, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Fantastic, fantastic. So there you go. 
basic scratching. Scratching is just literally turning a switch on and off. That's all it is. And that was invented in the South Bronx by Grand Wizard Theodore, who was influenced by the Leeds legend, Sir Jimmy Savile. So there you go. Thanks for listening. And come and see me at the break. Mr. Lee Jackson!